welcome to A B S E. Be sure to hit that subscribe button now. Hua. Guys, so in this container, which I have got over here, yeah, that was pretty late timing. Get down. So in this container, we have got something. We are rehousing. There we are. This is the geophilid centipede. Yeah, it looks different from my video ABSC layer of the geophilid centipede because that centipede which was shown in that video it was not it was not a geophilid centipede at all. Can you believe it? It was a total misidentification. So I was surfing through Google and checking centipedes with red heads and grey bodies because that's what the centipede looked like and then pictures of my species were coming so I thought it was a geophilic centipede well actually it was a Chinese red headed centipede can you believe it? so yeah let's get started and enough of the rambling so first of all an important update for you guys um, sorry for people talking in the background so yeah my cellar spider remember her she um, remember she laid an egg sack look at this now her egg sack has hatched into spider links. Focus phone, focus. Wait just a minute. I need to make this phone focus. Come on, why don't it? Look at the spider. She is here with her spider links yeah the spider links are white and after a few hours no after a few minutes they are going to harden and turn brown so let's get started on the geophilid centipede i need my camera stand because i am rehousing this centipede into her new enclosure yeah Sorry if there is uh, all this going in the video. It's just adjusting and stuff. I have to get my phone in position. Oh, come on. Yes. Yes. The phone is there. So, I have opened the container and I'm gonna remove this phone out. Ugh. Come out phone. I'm sorry if the phone is ringing. Yeah, that's someone else's. Anyway. Here is my geophilid centipede. Look at this cool creature. Her venom claws are open like this. Did you just see that? Like when I open, oh, ooh, 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 ooh. we just filmed it at the right moment. Whoa. So centipede's venom claws are actually modified legs as I explained in a previous video. Ah, uh, the phone is not focusing. So I have to deal with it and the video is already 4 minutes 33 seconds whoa oh 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 I think she is realigning her venom claws or she is adjusting them or whoa 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 whoa, whoa. this will be a good thumbnail for this video look at this 
Yuck. She is like in the freeze posture right now. Look at this centipede. Whoa. Can you see it? Obviously. But I'll keep it like this for a few more seconds. And now let's take a look at her from different angles. Can you believe it? The centipede is like literally frozen in its spot. That's a pretty cool start for the video. Now time to rehouse. The rehouse is going to go pretty easily. What is this here? So I'm just going to take the container like this. This is her new enclosure. It has soil, moss, a stick, etc. And since centipedes cannot climb smooth surfaces, done with the rehouse. Let's film her so for this time. Look at her. She is now ready to move. By the way, geophilic centipedes belong to order Geophilomorpha, and this one belongs to the genus. Geophilius um, and this enclosure is like a plastic bottle which I have recycled so yeah that will be it for today's video it was just like a random rehouse video which I filmed so yeah now the geophilic centipede has burrowed through the ground they are excellent at burrowing. Let's just, yeah, there she is. Let's see. All right, so this is ABSE um, signing out. We did not even need these materials. Goodbye.